So I'm here with Christine Robbins. She's a pitcher for Lower Columbia and oh, Lower Columbia who just won the South Division. So first question I have for you is, you know, the team has succeeded so far winning the division. What has been your overall experience for yourself and for the team as a whole? Um, for myself, I've just seen myself um, focus more and work harder on my pitching. And as a team, we just really work hard together, which is probably why we're so successful. Awesome. And then, you know, season's almost done. You only have two games left before the tournament. What has been the most memorable part of this year um, for you? Um, probably all the friendships I've made. We're all very different people. We all have big personalities, but we all seem to get along very well. And then, you know, for you being a pitcher, you know, it takes a little bit of extra work, it seems like, than other positions. What, are, what is your mindset when you take, you know, go out to the mound, go out to the rubber? What things do you think about? What things do you focus on? Um, usually I try not to think because if I do, I'll just mess up. So I usually just try and sing a song or think of something completely different. So, and then going from, from high school to college, you know, it's, you know, bigger competition, you know, players who have played the higher level. What has been the biggest adjustment you've had to make um, transitioning to the upper level? Um, probably with my pitching, because in high school, sometimes you can just throw it past them, but with college, you need to have more spins and a better change up, which was a really big difference. And then, you know, to make it this level, you got to have someone who pushes you and gets you going. Who's been your inspiration and kind of your motivator? Um, I'd have to say my dad, since he's always caught for me when I was pitching and always made sure I was at my practices on time and always helped me with my extra practices. Awesome. And then, you know, for, for both softball and baseball, there's a lot of routine to it and some superstitions. Do you have anything that you, you know, routinely do or even superstitious-wise that you have to do before each game? Um, um, I always go and get a monster and some white cheddar goldfish and I make sure I always like finish my monster before the drink and eat the goldfish before I start to pitch. <laughs> And the last question I have for you, you know, here you are at the college level. You have a lot of girls who are watching you at the games. What is some advice you have for the younger generation as they look forward to trying to make it to the college level themselves? Um, I'd say always keep it fun. Things will get serious, but your love for the game will never change. So just focus on that. Awesome. Well, thank you very much.